Hello friends, you're buddy Stone from CorkandMe.com. Welcome to day seven of the 2021 Cork and Me Adult Beverage Advent Calendar video series. Welcome to my new home in jolly old London town. Let's get right to today's beverage. And folks, today's beverage is, well, it's the first beer I picked up uh, going to the local market here. This is the Proper Job Powerfully Hopped IPA from St. Austell Brewery, founded in Cornwall, England in 1851. Can I give you a bunch of facts about this brewery, friends? No. Do I know a lot about this brewery, friends? No. I know that 80% of their sales are from their Tribute Ale. It's popular there in Cornwall. Don't really know a lot about it. Never had this particular IPA. Uh, it's 5.5%. I know there are three different types of hops in there. I believe we've got some... Uh, Oh gosh, I'll read the can in a minute and tell you. I know there's some Willamette hops in there, which is pretty cool. I think Willamette, Chinook, and uh, Cascade. You can double check my math help. I'll even tell you on the bottom of the screen here if I was right or not. Uh, on the nose of this, I'm getting uh, some nice bright citrus notes actually. Let's give it a taste. Oh wow, that can does not lie. This is a powerfully hot beer. Um, Fairly bitter on the uh, hop scale, I gotta be honest with you. I think it's balanced enough, but I am a bit of a hop head, so, um, you know, your casual IPA drinker or casual beer drinker may find this a little too hoppy with a little less uh, sweetness to balance that out. Uh, as for me, I love this. I would love to have this with some fish and chips or really any fried food. I think it'd go great with a burger, especially with creamy cheeses. Once again, friends, this is uh, this is the first beer I didn't recognize that wasn't a mass market uh, British beer in the market when we arrived last night to grab a few things for the new flats. Now, you know, I know the holiday season is second, friends, and gosh, no one knows that more than me this year, moving in the middle of the holiday season. I want to encourage all of us to take a deep breath, recognize what the season's about, which is spending time with family and friends, and maybe taking a deep breath and reassessing our lives a little bit and trying to figure out how we're gonna, I don't know, more enjoy things and more enjoy the people and awesome things in our lives. It doesn't mean everything's going perfectly for everyone all the time, because it's not. I don't wanna be a little Pollyanna here, but this is the time of year in which, you know, we get stressed and we get stressed unnecessarily because we get stressed about spending time with our friends and family. Well, I'm gonna tell you spending uh, the holidays here, which is the ribbon eye, which is quite enough, but uh, without our friends and family, uh, this is gonna be a poignant win for us. And uh, I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna do my best to take a deep breath, appreciate what I have, what I'm missing, and how to do better with life in the coming year. All right, friends, as always, thanks for watching and listening and joining and sharing and all those things. Until next time, be nice, be safe, and be happy. Cheers, friends.